almost looked like the fat was dissolved. It is. I want more of that. Hey guys, I am back at the cosmetic clinic. I'm filming a different way this time so it can be shared on YouTube and on Facebook. I am going back for my this is my fourth Morpheus 8 treatment. So I had three treatments last year around the same time, and it was recommended that I come back every year if I can to get it done. And this is one treatment that I absolutely wanna get done again because the results of those three treatments are so visible. I'm gonna share a picture right here for you of the before and after. This is something that will take a while to see the results. It's not an immediate thing like fillers and Botox. So I'm so happy that that I have the before and after pictures because it's very clear that this treatment works. Let's get that spot. Yeah. Kill the jowl. This device uses a microneedling uh, system of 24 needles that goes through the skin and then delivers the energy. So instead of traumatizing the skin on the way in, it actually passes the skin and then it does its job from the inside out. Every time you do this, the energy like just tightens and tightens the skin up and that's how it remodels. That's exactly what it is. It's microneedling mixed with radio frequencies. That's the top technology when it comes yeah. to skin tightening. And I get the top technology, yay! Yeah. We know that the downtime is minimal. We know that the results are gonna show immediately, right? Correct, so collagen takes a few weeks to take effect. And then it continues to grow for months. That's why our bodies are slow, but we're actually using our own DNA and fibroblasts to actually regrow. I'm gonna do a little bit of tightening around this area. And then I'm gonna start here. We're gonna do one depth everywhere, and then we're gonna do a deeper depth. And then at the end, we're gonna do some of the fattier, thicker spots with the deepest that we can, and we're gonna crank up the energy. So we're not doing the cheek area because we don't want to Correct. disturb the... Yeah, we don't want to disturb the fat, exactly. We want volume here. We would never want to remodel that fat. That's okay. really important. So a lot of um, like facial treatments will use like a 5% lidocaine. This is like a 30% um, oh, wow. mixture of different types of analgesic. Okay, I'm ready to go to the next level. Yes. Are you ready? Yep. Okay. Right here is your worst. Right. Okay, so this is where I'm going to focus right now. It's going to okay. be a little bit different. And we're going to do two pulses at once. This you get two shots of energy. Okay. You okay? Yeah. It's hard to talk when you're doing yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> no, definitely. Good job, yeah, For Julie. good luck. Yay. You did it. So for the first 24 hours, you just want to keep it protected um, and sealed with some some of this. So okay. Put some on for you. So tomorrow, we're, I'm doing the Vaseline yeah. the, for 24 for, hours um, okay. post treatment, okay. and you're just going to keep that nice barrier on so nothing gets in those little channels. So really, you're able to go back to your regular skincare at about day two. So I'm just in the car. I wanted to show you in the daylight what it looks like. Not so bad. You can see where she didn't touch and you can see where she did touch. And I'm going to check in tomorrow morning and show you what it looks like the day after. Good morning. It's the day after my Morpheus treatment. And I just wanted to show you that there is literally no downtime. I have a little bit of a bruise right there. Um, other than that, it looks like I've had nothing done. So very exciting. I hope this helps. So this is probably not the best top to have worn. Um, I did wear a V-neck though, so I, I was able to, you know, she's able to go down far if she needs to. She just put the numbing cream on. She uses a very good numbing cream. And I am going to take some Tylenol. So I'm gonna do the more piece on the neck first. Mm -hmm. Then I'm gonna come up here and do these areas right here. You really like, you don't honestly don't have a jaw. Look at how veiny I am, eh? What? Yeah. Oh, these are actually um, platismo bands. That's part of the muscle. These are veins, yeah. Oh, this is the platisse, platisse, oh. Yeah, it's a piece of, the, so like, go like this. See it popping out? Yeah. Yeah, we don't have big veins like that. Just I'm like, exposed. I'm like the Hulk. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's fine. It's fine? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And you didn't feel that, or you're okay? Yeah, I'm good actually. Okay. And I'm just going based on what I know we've talked about in the past and the treatments we've done, but just refresh my memory on what worries you the most or what concerns you the most about the neck. Would you say you, you're more concerned about something midline? Yeah. Do you think it's the whole thing? Yeah, I would say so. Okay. I want to make sure I'm targeting what you see, not just what yeah, I see. Yeah, no, no. When I look at the picture, not only did it tighten everything else, but the it almost looked like the fat was dissolved. It is. I want more of that. So later on, we'll go up to the up back into this area yeah. with the deeper ones and get that thumb melted. It's really just 
laxity in the skin of the mm -hmm. neck. But what's great about the neck skin is that it actually has the ability to transform if yeah. you manipulate it. The neck skin is different than the face skin. It bounces back better. This isn't okay. bad today. Good. Yay. RF microneedling, you, oh, there isn't anything better right now, and until there is, we're going to keep doing this. Yeah. Now, how long did you stay red for before? Do you remember? Not long. I think the next day I was fine, or even hours after, it was good. So this is that fat melting right now. So it's not feeling great. It's actually not bad. It's not bad? Okay. Mm -hmm. I can feel it kind of go to yeah. the deepest. Yep. It's the stacking energy. So mm -hmm. the needles aren't going any deeper, but the energy is, yeah. and that's how you're getting down to the fat. Yeah. Remember the one time that was so painful for me. I don't know. Maybe I was just off that day. Well, it could be so many different things. Mm -hmm. our, our pain thresholds can be quite high a lot, and then when some days you're just over it. Mm -hmm. you know, like your body is tense on everything. Yeah. You have cramps in one area of your body, or you're just not managing well. Tightening this skin. It all, it's all connected, right? So if you mm -hmm. tighten up here, it tightens. You tell me if it's getting too hot. Oh, I'm point. good. Oh my god, we're already almost at 500. Good job, Julie. Yay. So red. <laughs> yeah, you are. Let's let me know it's working. I feel like a sunburn for a little bit. But yeah. The stinging part does it goes yeah. away. Perfect. Yay, that was good. So, yeah, that was awesome. You just sailed through it. Yeah. Some days, it's weird. Some days you just like. The only thing I'm finding is my hands are sweaty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 We've some footing for RF microneedling. It's in the evidence, it's in the research. There's yeah. no question about it dominating, bringing all this collagen. My whole philosophy is about using adjacent tissues to pull and tighten. And if oh. I if they don't do it evenly, then that's against my philosophy. There we go. Okay. A couple little spots of bleeding. Okay, no biggie. This is a new look. <laughs> it it looks funny. Look, even up here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah like, it's like someone's going like this to you. <laughs> yeah. See, I feel like the redness is already starting to go down. It is, it, it is. There's a little bit of a white cast from the lotion we put on too, so that oh. also could be. Because right here, no, it's it? starting to yeah, light it's modeling. Up. So, yeah. Yeah, so that's what happens. It's gonna model like that. It's gonna yeah. look a little marbly. Some of the color's gonna go away, but then it will all come back. Oh, okay. When it relaxes a little bit. This is actually shunting blood away from certain areas, preserving it for other areas. Oh, That's what's going on, cool. but it, it will come back. Yeah. God, the body's smart, the body isn't is it? So smart. I mean, you might not love it right now. I don't love it right now, you but know I, where it's going. I know, I know I will love it. It is 6.44. I filmed on my phone, by the way, and this is my good camera. So you can see that I am quite red, but not so bad, you know? I had a shower, so there were a little bit of blood marks here. Um, when I showered, it all came off. You can see close up, not so bad here. Where it is red is on my neck, but honestly, that could be covered with makeup, but I think by tomorrow, it's gonna be fine. And I am so excited that that really didn't hurt. Now, I did take two extra strength Tylenols before I went in, and she numbed me very well, like it was over an hour. So that might have made a difference because I've never taken Tylenol before I go in. Don't take Advil. Advil is a blood thinner. So definitely you would want to take Tylenol instead. Ask your doctor or your nurse practitioner first, of course, or your esthetician, whoever's doing it. But I was very, very surprised. I would not have been able to communicate during one of my sessions. My first session last time was good. My second session was painful. And the third one wasn't bad. So out of four treatments, there was only one that was made me kind of squirm out of my chair a little bit, but today was good. So I will remember, I'll put a note in my calendar for about five months down the road to do it before and after comparison. At the end of October, I'm gonna be announcing a date where we're gonna go live, Nurse Chelsea and I, and we're gonna have an opportunity, or you're gonna have an opportunity to ask her questions live. She has been treating me since 2019. It's a great opportunity for you guys to ask her questions, especially if you're in the Ottawa area Area or the surrounding area here in Canada because you can see her but even still even if you can't see her it doesn't matter she'll happily answer your questions when that time comes I'll talk about it more and we're gonna go live on Facebook and on YouTube yeah I'm really looking forward to that comment below that helps me out so much it helps the YouTube algorithm understand that you actually like my videos if you did like this video hit the like button hit the subscribe button before you leave and the notification bell share with all your friends and I will see you soon Bye.